This is the last time that I, Dr. Wellbody, the rhyming pediatrician, will be meeting with you. I've had a great time getting to know you, and I hope you've learned a lot. Here is a poem that talks about some of the things we've discovered. I have a special body, and it just belongs to me. There are some parts on my outside and others I can't see. I know about my body from my heels up to my head because I've listened well to all that Dr. Wellbody has said. The parts that make up my body keep me healthy and alive. They are joined in groups called systems. I've learned about all five. There are skeletal and muscular, which help me stand and move and the system called digestive that makes fuel out of food. My heart and vessels move my blood that's known as circulation. My nerves work with my brain to get and process information. My systems form a network it's amazing as can be that this complicated network makes the person that is me. After all we've learned about our amazing bodies, I'll bet that now you will be able to answer the questions I asked you in our very first meeting. Let's go through them and see what you know. How many bones do you have in your body? There are over 200 joined together to form your skeleton. Your skeleton keeps you standing tall. Your bones are joined together by joints wherever you bend or move, like your knees, arms, and shoulders. Some of your bones protect the softer parts of your body. Remember what protects your brain? That's right, your skull. And what bones protect your heart? Your ribs. Which muscle is the biggest in your body? It's your gluteus maximus, or buttock muscle. Did you know that you use muscles every time you move? Often you decide when you want to move your muscles. For example, you have control over when you raise your arm or lift your leg. But some muscles work by themselves without your having to think about them. Does anyone remember what we call the muscle that works like a pump all day and all night to keep you alive? Yes, it's your heart. Why does your body still have food in it today that you ate two days ago? Food moves slowly through your body. It takes time for your body to digest food, taking all the nutrients from it that your body needs before getting rid of the waste. Food goes from your mouth, down your esophagus, and into your stomach before reaching your intestines. The saliva in your mouth and the juices in your stomach help break it down. Nutrients are absorbed into your bloodstream from your small intestine. The waste passes into your large intestine, and you get rid of it when you go to the bathroom. How long does it take for your blood to circulate all around your body? It only takes about one minute. Your heart muscle works hard to pump your blood all around. The blood moves through your blood vessels. Does anyone remember what the blood carries with it on its superhighway? The blood carries oxygen from your lungs to all parts of your body. It carries nutrients from your food, too. Your heart works night and day to keep your blood circulating. What controls your five senses? Your brain. You find out about the world through your senses by seeing, hearing, tasting, smelling, and feeling. Nerves that connect to your spinal cord carry this information to your brain. Your brain is not only in charge of your senses, it also controls your thinking, learning, speech, and memory. It controls the movements you make and many other things your body does. Your brain is the control center of the body. Remember that none of the systems of your body can work properly unless you take care of them. That means eating nutritious foods and drinking plenty of water, exercising, keeping clean, and getting plenty of sleep. Oh, and don't forget to visit a doctor like me for checkups. Now, before we say goodbye, 
Here's one final rhyme for you to learn and take away with you. I've got a complicated body, but I understand it well. Its systems form a network to keep me feeling swell. I'll take good care of my body. I'll exercise and rest. I promise to eat healthy foods and to stay clean. I'll do my best.